agreement with you in terms of what he brings and his pluses. He's also a gold glove outfielder, and I think if you have him in left field next year, the Yankees would be pleased with that. When they acquired Benintendi, they acquired him for a reason. They knew it was only for the rest of the season, but they liked the players' makeup enough. So I could very easily see the Yankees making a move to bring him back. We put Cabrera on that graphic, and he deserved that. But I see Cabrera's role with the Yankees next season as a guy who can play all over. I think there's tremendous value there. He showed this year that that is not a deterrent to him still being able to produce. So I think that's his role. And even though it will be at a high price tag, I still think the Yankees believe that Hicks can be someone who gives them something off the bench as an extra outfielder. Remember, he's a switch hitter. As John said, he's a guy who works the count and can work some walks. Those are things that are of value to the Yankees. And whenever people want to shed a player, I always say to them, well, what are you getting back? Because the Yankees aren't just going to give Hicks away because he happens to make $10 million. All right.